Hi, you guys. I just started making a video, and then I had this huge yawn, so I had to start over. Anyway, uh, it's 4.15 in the morning, and I'm listening. I, I was listening to the thunder roll in, and now it is raining, and it is just so wonderful. I, I don't even want to go to sleep because I want to listen to the rain. Anyway, uh, so guess what happened today? Um, late this afternoon, I went to Costco to get something, came home. It's real close to where I live. And, um, I, I, I came to a stop sign on a side street and there was a, a guy sitting on the curb with his dog and a little girl standing there with a little princess dress on. And for some reason, it just seemed odd to me. Like he could easily have been taking a break. The dog may have wanted a break. But I, I just, something in me told me to um, ask him if he was okay. And so I rolled my window down. I said, are you okay? And he goes, oh yeah, everything's okay. I just called the police. This little girl was out here wandering and doesn't know, you know, where she came from. I think she may have been at a backyard birthday party. I said, okay, you already called the police? He said, yeah. And the little girl was standing there scared to death. Okay, so I'm, th I am I know she's fine, you know, because the police were going to come and get her. But can you imagine the mother that drops her kid off at a birthday party? Oh, by the way, this little girl was probably f four. I'm going to say four. Can you imagine getting, I mean, let's just say that the friendship between the mother of that girl and who, whoever's house she was at, that friendship's over. <laughs> because obviously they were going to take that little girl straight to the police station and then wait till they received a call about a missing child. Because obviously she hadn't given anybody her name or anything. Maybe three and a half, I'd say. Or three and a half to four years old. Anyway... I just kept thinking about that this afternoon, and I wanted to call the non-emergency line just to make sure everything was okay, but you know it was. But can you imagine somebody not keeping an eye and letting one of those little kids roam? Man, it would have been the wrath of me if that had been my kid, and I ended up getting a call from the police about my kid wandering. Oh my gosh. Anyway... So that, that happened this afternoon and, um, yeah, nothing, nothing else really, just a lot, but that's all I really wanted to talk about. Uh, and that's it. Kind of a boring little vlog, but I just wanted to tell a story. What would you do if you dropped your little child off at a birthday party and you get a call from the police? By the way. The neighborhood that they were in was a pretty decent neighborhood, but that doesn't mean that your kid's not going to get picked up by somebody that drives by and thinks, hmm, okay, you know, spur of the moment decision. You just never know what people are capable of. So uh, what would you do if you got a call from the police? Wouldn't you just like have a heart attack? Uh, we have your child here. They were uh, found on the street in a neighborhood. Nobody was there Oh my gosh. Anyway, let me know what you would do. Because I know what I would do. <laughs> Alright. Bye guys.